<clears throat> dragon creature. It's a mythical creature. It's said to live in the Mekong River. And uh, it comes out every so often. I think once a year there's a date for it. I'd have to look it up though. And that's when it's believed it comes out. It's supposed to shoot fireballs out, right? If I'm wrong, somebody correct me because this is pretty interesting. So, this trip is made possible by Ho Tong Pet and Manang. We finished with the wedding and we made it over to Suwana Kid. Now, they brought me over to this temple grounds tourist attraction type thing. Just talking to the lady where we bought our drinks to cool down and refresh before we walked around. And she said that before COVID, this place was packed. He also said that Ho Tong Pit was saying that this place was packed before. It just hasn't recovered yet. How you not? Mm. How you not? Oh, there it is. I've heard the stories in Lao before, but it's been a long, long time ago. So, somebody refresh us on the Hanyanak story. Hmm, lots of shines. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, lady. Leg this on to her, to her, to her, look out here, no? first coconut avocado shake delicious for like a dollar not even somebody gave me some money at the wedding I don't know what that was about but I didn't know who to give it to so here we go Ooh, let's make it look nice first let's see all that gold is coming to us this year. <laughs> Alright, we got 4,000 now, it looks like. Next. Next one, next one. I don't know where I'm pointing the camera. No, why? Ah, oh, come on. It's gonna be a good year. What young man? What bad hum tea? What bad hum tea? What bad hum tea? He meant born succeed. What mean? What mean? What mean? What mean? What mean? Of course, there's gonna be chickens. <laughs> Surprised I haven't seen any dogs or cats yet. Where are they hiding? See? Now we've learned since the last videos that most things are gonna have one of these plaques. Satasan. Built by the faith of whoever's name's on there. Nimen Hupanyan. I don't know what this person is. Nang something. One of the mythical creatures that I don't know anything about. If you do, let me know. This is probably a place I wouldn't normally look up and come to but it's interesting when you come with locals and hopefully Ho Tong Pet joins us in a second <clears throat> excuse me because he'd have a lot of the answers to what the stuff is huh? uh, Pa Tong Pa you say can I look okay now you this stuff is called duckweed, is that what it's called? Correct me if I'm wrong, but... <clears throat> Excuse me. I've 
definitely had people tell me that this uh, that she's a pretty decent price. So that's why they grow it. So sometimes the statues out in this area can be can be intimidating. Let's see what it says down there. Blue and palm. Maybe they're gonna grow some duckweed or whatever that stuff is here too. This is what you gotta love about Lao. Like all along the riverside, it's very hilly, mountainous. And so you get great views of the river, great sunsets. All along the river, which runs through the whole country. You have waterfalls running into the river you never know what's going to go into the rivers here beautiful 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 this one's pretty different it's kind of done in 3d almost i was looking at it i was like wait a second is that painted only or is no there is parts that have come out off the wall but it's done really well done it looks pretty cool just inside her. Different. I've seen. This would be a place to have somebody really give an explanation. I don't want to go in without my shoes coming off. Um, do I even need to pay? I don't. I'm gonna have to take off my shoes because I can't go in here with my shoes on. It's not even allowed. Okay, so I'm trying to read this. It looks like it's uh, like a chant. Some's got like people getting messed up on <laughs> smoking tobacco. <laughs> Alright, this might have been worth the trip here. These pictures are gnarly. I don't know what that guy's doing with the animal. Eating it raw or something? I don't know. These people fighting, this dude's drinking, that dude's smoking. But what does that say? Sulame Lanya Mat Sapa. Holy smokes, who knows? Who knows? I could have got that all wrong. <laughs> but it's fun to try. Very beautiful murals. They're covering a massive space. So. Now, where's the gong? We need to do this for good luck. I donated over there, I didn't donate here. I do apologize if I... But it's all... Blessings to... Pao Tong Pet and Ma Nang and Sao King for making this trip possible. hospitality may you have success and happiness throughout this year and going forward blessings to all of us else all of us else <laughs> it's close to the new year so my best wishes to all of you out there that you've got nothing but good things to come the rest of this year and going forward. Sad. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs>
fucking crazy, just want to film. Oh, I didn't notice they were naked. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Are we supposed to do this one too? I think so. May everybody out there that has a dream have the confidence to go for it. <laughs> that is not good. I'm supposed to use this one? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, I feel really silly. Oh gosh, I'm not breaking nothing. That's enough of that. But because I had that I wish for everybody that would make it happen. Is that a thing? Well, now it is. We can talk like that in a place like this, right? What's that good? Nyang pet tin la la. Kedai ngoh. We're going barefoot. What's that? What's that? This is the one that came to you. 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 So we made it to the riverside in Suwanakade, just gonna have a wander. Is Suwanakade known for... Pan Man, that word's killing me today. Is Suwanakade known for the Panyanak? Because there are sure a lot of these Panyanak. <laughs> it's really not that hard to say, is it? Come on. Panyanak. Panyanak. Without that, nyon yun, pat nyan nya, pat nya, pat nya na, ko hai mi so. We have the greatest palm prosperity. Ko hai mi so, ni lab, ni am na, wat sana. Okay, mang kang lam luai, lam luai. Hang hang. Can we get that right one time for? Ko hai mi. You need to be a little cooler for like a not long walk along the riverside right now. It is still very warm. Four o'clock. Love you. I love you now. What is this flag supposed to be? Is this a Savannah Kid flag? Savannah Kid. Oh, that's nice. So, did I ever get this high? My guess is it used to be. At least down to one level down there, no? What do you think, guys? I wonder where we're gonna stay tonight. I hope it's close to a gym because it would be amazing if I could get up and do the gym tomorrow. Three days, no gym. Should have filmed my home workout at uh, the hotel there. I got like water bottles, two of them, and use those for different lifts, carries, yeah, push ups, dips. There was a big block of seam that I used for. Some curls. <laughs> if I come here, man. Let me get that eight pack, baby. <laughs> One thing I do miss, I don't go to the gym. Like I do a lot of pull-ups and different things on the bars. It's just so good for your joints, stretch you out. Without it, I get so
so sore. Loosen up. Playing some, what do you call it in, in English, I don't even know. It's a French game, but I'm not sure what it's called in Mali, either. Beton. Fun game though. Trying to get it closest to the red marker. You can knock each other's balls out of the way. I'm gonna sit down and ask because I can't remember the name of this game. Don't call Kai and Fideng Dang Bok. They're having a party over there. <laughs> here, got a serious game going down. I love how they have like the overhand grip to get the backspin on it. So get them. Check them. Get them. Get them. Okay, so you win. Check them. Can I get help? Oh, I like you know. <laughs> He's saying that like you, a lot of times they play for a, a million game for uh, a round, not a round, but like uh, yeah, match between the two teams. That's a lot, man. 50 bucks, he said sometimes a, a million, 50, sometimes 25, sometimes 15, but he said often they pay for a million, which is like $50. <laughs> He's right next to it. Oh, he's, wow, great shot. Nailed it. Oh, wow. Game ball. Oh, he won the game on that one. Hell of a round for that guy. First he hit the guy out that was right next to it, then he landed his closest. Wow, that was a hell of a shot. Two shots in a row. He won the match, or won the round. So he's saying that sometimes they win in just two rounds and get the four of the first round, three of the second. So ask them how many rounds they usually like play. So I'm guessing that if you land it closest, you get two or three points. 
have a chance to ask. Guys, should I talk them? Guys, should I talk them? อ๋อในแท่งเดียวเลยก็เรียนปัญญาวะอ๋อแท่งเดียวสิได้แท่งเนาะแล้วเขาได้เรียนดีเลยไปเสียงเนี่ยเสียงเนี่ยเสียงเ